We began by asking about the claim that she is the other woman in this D.C. divorce filing. Hi, Representative Omar. I just had a quick question. I'm not uh, in the media or anything like that, but Can I just... Can you turn that up or not? Okay, up, fair, fair, fair enough. I, I simply want to ask... Can you turn that I, phone off? Are you separated from your husband? Are you dating somebody? No, I am not. And I, I have, like, said yesterday, I have no interest in really um, allowing to, 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 you know, the conversation about my personal life to continue. Uh, and so I have no desire to discuss it. Good question. Yes. Set the record straight when it comes to the Politico interview. I just want to get to your side of the story. Representative Omar also declined to discuss continued accusations that at one point she married her brother for immigration purposes, an allegation that first surfaced three years ago and that she repeatedly has called absurd. I mean, I know who I am. Um, the people I love know who I am and what I care about. And I have, you know, three beautiful little children and a family to care for. And so for me, my focus is really uh, in, in doing the work that I feel like I was destined to do. CARE was founded after 9-11 because they recognized that some people did something and that all of us were starting to lose access to our civil liberties. We need to make sure that we cut and not put increases on spending on detention facilities. Woo! We need to stop using DHS as a slush fund. We need to abolish ICE Woo! and end all inhumane deportation and detention programs. Something that I, I get criticized for all the time. It's not what you think, so don't, like, <laughs> don't gasp. Um, it is that like, I, I am anti-American because I, I criticize the, the United States. And I, I, I believe as an immigrant, I probably love this country more than anyone that is naturally born. And because I am ashamed of it continuing to live in its, the hypo its hypocrisy, that I work so hard to make sure that others who've had um, that, like, why, just be American, why don't you be more like an American, can continue to say that. Why can't you be more like an American? Because it, it used to be a very positive thing. Um, we export American exceptionalism, the great America, the land of liberty and justice. That is, you know, if you ask anybody in uh, walking on the side of the street somewhere in the middle of the world, they will tell you America the great. But we don't live those values here. Um, and so that hypocrisy is one that I'm bothered by. I want America the great to be America the great.